wonderful educational experience on top of all the science that we're collecting and so on. So this, the whale's 50 feet long? The whale is 50 feet long, uh, actually exactly 50 feet long. And this yeah. animal was found floating off Skudik Point? Or originally found floating off Skudik Point by a fisherman, reported to Coast Guard as a hazard of navigation, and then Coast Guard uh, then reported it to us because we are the group in this region. We cover from the border down to Rockland any marine mammal that is found dead or is uh, considered stranded or in distress. Um, so this very much falls under our ballywick. Um, we have a lot of experience cutting up these large animals. Um, this is our second sperm whale uh, in about six or seven years. Hmm. Uh, in the interim, we've, we've cut up plenty of baleen whales, minke whales, and so on. Um, so that, those are all good practice. Really, the sperm whale represents uh, the, the mother of all whale cuts because they are so heavy, they are so dense. Um, as you probably heard, I was mentioning this head region here weighs about 30,000 pounds, which is why this guy, as powerful as it is, just simply cannot do anything with it. So, and you notice how easily it pulled up the body. So just imagine how head heavy these creatures are. Uh, so yeah, it, it's, um, it's, a, it's a phenomenal animal. They're chunky, they're big, they're, they're greasy. Uh, so really you have to uh, you, you, you have to be very, very well prepared for an event like this. Do you know if this is a, a male or a female? It, it, it was a male. A male. It was a male. And at that size and weight, it makes the animal uh, not quite, but almost fully grown. It was probably reproductively mature, 